So today we're going to talk about the gastroduodenal artery and its significance with the Whipple operation. So basically it's the head of the pancreas that you're going to remove. And this is the blood supply to the head of the pancreas, the gastroduodenal artery. So this artery has to go. So what you do is you dissect around the artery, get a vessel loop around it, then put a vascular clamp, and then you put your other hand in the hilum and you feel for a pulse or you put a Doppler and you're gonna hear shh, 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 an arterial signal. So then once you've confirmed that this is a gastrodrenal artery, then you tie it. You don't tie it first and then confirm because once you tie an artery, unlike the vein, the artery dissects and it cannot be untied or used because it has dissected. So you have to confirm it. Why do you have to confirm it? Because based on your dissection, you may be dissecting up here or you may be dissecting up here. So when you are dissecting up here, you won't be getting a signal up there. So that's why you have to make sure that you are dissecting the gastroduodenal artery and you're not on the hepatic artery per se. Now, sometimes when you're dissecting more up, then what you do is you just dissect a little bit lower and you'll be fine. You get a, you don't have a signal here, you don't have a pulse here, but as you dissect it more down, now you, you the return, of pulse and blood flow is there, so you're good to go. So then you can clamp it. And that is how you uh, identify and then uh, clamp the GDA and then tie it off before uh, you confirm. Now, one important um, aspect of this care is that sometimes what you thought was the GDA is actually if you track it all the way down, it is going behind the pancreas and is coming off the SMA. And this is what the celiac access is here and this is what the aorta is so basically this is the replace left and this was the replace right and this is the replace side behind the pancreas so when you tie this off again before you tie this off you feel for a pulse you feel for a signal you're not going to get it because this is not the gda this is the right hepatic artery now what if you tie it off what happens is that this patient is going to come or be in Post update one, two, three with rising LFTs, with cholangitis, and then he's gonna have liver failure. So again, very important before you tie off the GDA to know it is the GDA. Thank you.